Freemasons from far and wide gathered in Kamasi to honor Most Worshipful Brother Odom IV Osei Tutu II, Grand Patron of the Grand Lodge of Ghana, on two significant milestones. His 25th anniversaries on the Golden Stool and in Freemasonry. The Grand Lodge of Ghana was formally founded on January 24, 2009, as a sovereign Masonic body. It oversees a significant number of subordinate lodges and is grouped into four provincial Grand Lodges. Southwest Cape Coast, Southeast Accra, North Kamasi, and East Lomivolta. The United Grand Lodge of England was the first to recognize the newly constituted Grand Lodge of Ghana. Most Worshipful Brother Charles William Stanley Pierre was installed as the first Grand Master, followed by Most Worshipful Brother Odwazium Osei Nyampong VI in 2013, and Most Worshipful Brother N. Kapkwajo Adunkwa Bata in 2017. The current Grand Master, Most Worshipful Brother Nana Osei Atwini Bonsu, assumed office in May 2021. The Grand Lodge's motto, that all shall be one, reflects its commitment to unity. The celebration took place at the Brother Odom IV Sir Agumang Primpe II's Masonic Hall on May 25, 2024. The ceremony was attended by brethren from various Grand Lodges G, including Grand Lodge of Liberia, led by MWB Anthony W. DeLine, United Grand Lodge of England, represented by Most Worshipful Brother Charles William Stanley Pierre and Grand Master Designate of the Grand Lodge in Nigeria, High Chief Oziobi Eric Okodi. Also present were current Grand Master, Most Worshipful Brother Nana Osei Etwini Bonsu, Most Worshipful Brother Atwasum Osei Nyampong VI, Most Worshipful Brother N. Kapkwajo Adunkwa Bita and Brother Nana Kwaku Boatsing, all Omenheen of New Juaben. Later in the evening, Following the formal Masonic ceremony, Masonic brethren from various Grand Lodges in the world were hosted at a banquet at the Jubilee Hall in Mencia, fostering a spirit of unity and brotherhood among attendees. At the event, the Grand Lodge and Osei Tutu Lodge donated 300,000 Ghana CDs and 25,000 Ghana CDs, respectively, to support Asanta Hain's Heal Okomfo Enoki Hospital Project. The Grand Lodge of Ghana expressed his satisfaction with Most Worshipful Brother Odom IV Osei Tutu's 25-year membership in Freemasonry. Most Worshipful Brother Odom IV Osei Tutu II, in his speech stated that he was initiated into Freemasonry 25 years ago, and there is no doubt that in joining a society or club, one cannot help but wonder what benefit or restrictions await. Reflecting on his journey, he acknowledged his initial concerns about joining the organization and the impact it has had on his life. He also stated that in the case of Freemasonry, you are left to worry more without knowing exactly what you are going to face and with no one ready to tell you what you want to know. Despite these initial uncertainties, the Asantehin affirmed his positive experience. Odom IV emphasized his commitment to making Freemasonry beneficial to Ghana and its citizens while promoting peace. He expressed optimism about the future growth of the Grand Lodge, highlighting the importance of dedicated members who will provide relief to the needy and uphold truth. On my part, I am committed to make the contribution of Freemasonry useful to our nation, Ghana, <coughs> excuse me, and fellow, Ghan and fellow Ghanaians, and at the same time, promote peace among our nation and this side of the world. 25 years ago, I was initiated into Freemasonry. There's no doubt, no doubt that in joining a society or club, one cannot help but wonder what benefits and restrictions await one. In the case of Freemasonry, you are left to one, worryingly wonder, more without knowing exactly what you are going to face, and with no one ready to tell you what you want to know. Whatever doubts or reservations might have crossed my mind. All I can say after the 25 years period is that I have no regrets on being a Freemason. <laughs>